24-year-old Yakao has come to Diffa to build a new life for herself. Along with hundreds of other refugees, she fled from Boko Haram across the Nigerian border to escape danger. Many young people like Yakao have had a difficult start to life. The trouble in her homeland has seen her school studies disrupted. This meant she had few skills and found it hard to secure a job. The International Fund for Agricultural Development, or IFAD, and its partners support a training program for unemployed youth and refugees that teaches them new skills and how to work together. Yakao has learned food processing skills like making spaghetti from the local moringa plant and how to make cleaning products like washing powder. Working with the government of Niger, IFAD's investment is part of a wider strategy to help young people become local entrepreneurs, which in turn helps the local economy. In the case of la Réunion d'Ivoire, we give young people a means to do these activities economic to guard them in their territory. We don't want that the young people are tempted, either in the exode, either in the migration. We want to guard them in their territory around the ouvrages of production. Now, the COVID-19 pandemic has provided them with an extra source of income. 200 liters of liquid soap they had made before the outbreak have now been sold to the local health center. So far, the scheme has transformed the lives of over 80 young people, offering them both financial and emotional security. With more refugees arriving all the time, the scheme hopes to give many more young people a clean start.